As Europe faces the arrival of more than one million refugees, EU countries say they will offer immediate protection to Ukrainians fleeing the war. In an unusual show of unity on migration, every member state signed off Thursday on an agreement that would see displaced people coming from Ukraine given blanket protection for up to three years. And I think this is a real great... We have received already in Europe almost one million refugees from Ukraine. We're going to see millions more. And that is really why we need more solidarity and why we need this proper legislation to give the protection to people, to give them their rights. And of course, we're also going to need additional fundings. The so-called temporary protection directive will apply to Ukrainian nationals. It includes, among other things, residency rights, access to employment, access to housing, access to social welfare and medical assistance, as well as access to the education system. And while the speed at which Brussels has reacted to Russia's invasion of Ukraine is unprecedented, some are saying more can still be done for refugees. In addition to triggering the TPD, we need to see rapid deployment of EU funding under the AMIF emergency provisions. We need to see the EU asylum agency providing support, including operations, and member states requesting that kind of support from the agency. Uh, above all, the crucial thing is to remain united also in the response to displacement uh, for security reasons as well as for humanitarian reasons. The temporary protection directive will only be applied to non-Ukrainians if member states wish to do so, after the proposal was watered down at the last minute. The measure has never been used before and was created following the 2001 refugee crisis in Kosovo. Christopher Pitches, Euronews, Brussels.